Okay, guys. So we're in the last part now. We went over the first two videos already. We talked about creating the roof and the sides of the walls of the of the sketch that I created here. And also I created these folders, right, to organize my equations so they're not all over the place. Okay, so now we're gonna move on to the door. And there's a lot of these other features that we can do uh, also, but I wanna do the door because the door is gonna be a little interesting, okay? It kinda looks like a parabola, right, if you think about it, okay? So here's the thing I wanna do, okay? So to make a parabola, you guys need to use the quadratic equation. Now it's backwards, right? I mean, it's going up in this case. So let's make it go down. So we wanted to flip it or, or we wanted to um, be reflected down. So I'm making negative. Okay, so this doesn't help because it's down here, right? So this is not, it's not, it's not gonna help me because I need it here, right? And it's down here. So this is not too much. So I want to make the vertex up here. All right. So let me move it up. So I'm going to move it up. And it's about between 2 and 3. So I'm going to put maybe 2.5. Actually, 2.5. No. So, uh, it's maybe 2.1. No, maybe 2.2. .2. Okay. So now I want to move it to the right. And if you remember, I got to add the parentheses here. I gotta move it to the right, and let me move it about one. No, that's too much. So maybe 0 0.5. No, not enough. Uh, 0 0.65 maybe. Okay. So do you guys see what I'm doing? I'm I'm kind of like making the equation try to fit my line here. Okay. Now this is the thing. I this is not where I I wanted to trace the the doorway. Okay. I wanted to trace the door. So let me make it a little bit smaller. If I make it, if I put two, it's gonna go, it, it, it helps. So let me get a little bigger, three, six. Okay, six went a little bit too much. Uh, what about five? Five a little bit too much. What about four? Kind of getting there. But here's what I want to show you guys. Let me turn over the picture. Do you see? It doesn't really fit it too well, right? Like the more, I, the more, uh, the more, the bigger the number I make it, the, it's not fitting it as well as I want it to. So what can I do? So let me maybe maybe get a decimal, 2.5, 2.9. It's still not really what I want it to look like, 3.2, 3 3.9, 3. Okay. So here's the thing. The, the parabola, even though it looks close to it, it's not really the shape I want it to be. And I'm going to go from my highest point, which is 2.2. .2, to about zero and so i'm going to tell desmos that i want to go from zero i want to change the range from zero to about 2.2 .2. okay so at least it kind of looks a little bit better but if you notice it's not really working this equation isn't really tracing the uh the door okay so i can try another equation and I'm gonna turn this one off right now, and I wanna I wanna show you guys another one. So here's the thing: what about if I use x maybe to the third? Okay. So it doesn't really, it really doesn't. It's still here, right? But maybe I can use like half of it. How about this? How about if I do this? If I move it, I'm gonna move it up. So I wanted to move it at two point two, and then I'm gonna move it to the right again. And I'm going to use the same trick I used before. Remember, when we do these transformations, I'm going to move it to 0 0.64, about there. Okay? Okay, so it's about the middle right there, 0 0.6.4. And then let me see if I can maybe make it a little bit smaller. So let me add 2. Okay, see, you guys see how it's kind of forming the door a little bit better? Okay. It's a little bit better. Okay. 5, maybe so it's kind of working right but the thing is i don't want the rest of this line so i would say i would only want to cut it at maybe 6.4 okay so here's what i'm going to do in the next video i'm going to finish this because this this is not perfect right so i'm going to finish the rest of this uh pro uh this issue of the doorway in the next video and think about it like what kind of equation could i use to try to trace it since the quadratic didn't work perfectly okay we'll do it in the next one